righty, there it is. <laughs> the lobster's rig ready to go down. Monster Cabrera snapper. Oh, he's Jesus. trying to snap, oh my God. Look at those teeth right there. Oh, he's angry. All right, here's a scoop. Lobster season opened up last week. We're gonna go try to catch a Cabrera snapper. We'll even bun Maris in a few minutes. We got a live well loaded. We got Foster with us, we got Max. We have got 24 lobsters in there. Now see that one lobster right there with that orange piece of dacron? That's a lucky lobster. Sarah caught that lobster and told us to go drop it tonight. I've never caught a Cabrera. Max just caught his big first one last night on a different boat. So we're gonna see if we can catch one tonight. We'll be tugging on some beasts. Vic is the primary angler. Swordfish extraordinaire. We even got pizza courtesy of Foster. Right there. We got pizza and we got chicken. Mustache is back. It's the mustache and Max. Going live, going for Camara. We got Frosty down there. We got pizza right there. Here we go. Alright, we just ran all the way up here. Hopefully gonna catch us a Cabrera snapper. We'll see. So we got all them live lobsters. Sun setting, you can see that storm in the background. We got our pens, couple 80 wide. We got a fresh new 70 wide. We got 130 pound braid on that. I'm gonna rig it up here and get ready. Here we go. Using them lobsters for bait. Hopefully they're still alive. Oh yeah, they're looking good in there. Look at them bugs. Never thought we'd be using a lobster for bait. Rigged up, a pair of big hooks right there. To get these lobsters on there and get them down. Not really a secret spot. There's some boats out here right now. Can you see them? Getting ready. Make sure you got the best on in case it goes from them. We don't want that. I got a wedding lobster poster. That was easy. There you go. Right there. The easy if it was an easy catch, catch, I don't know if that's a winner, you know? Yeah, true. Eh, he looks like a good starter, though. Just a little light in the sky. All right, there it is. The lobster's rig ready to go down. We got a Pen 70 with 130 pound braid. Stand up rod and Vic is in the black magic harness. Going down, first drop. The lobster's on the bottom, now we wait. I was growing this mustache out, I heard there's good luck for Cabarrus. If Vic has one, I want one. Big mark coming up. Okay, we did our first drop. I'm gonna check the bait. I got nervous for a second, but never really came tight or nothing. Looked like maybe a boat or two hooked up. We got a great bait. Still look really good on the hook. Two. Here we go, going down, drop number two. We're Boats out here, got the moon coming up out there, full moon. Sun's going down, another boat coming up now. There. All right, checking our bait there. We're checking our bait. A lot of boats there, about 15 boats now. Everyone's hoping for the old Cabrera. Looks. Oh yeah, he got whacked. Look. Oh, he got Look at that. That looks like a Cubaris whacking the side out of him. Uh, that looks like a snapper mouth, doesn't it? One side snap from a snapper a... mouth. I think we had a bite. Let's get back down there. Keep it for dinner. Right. Yep. Still got some dinner there. Well, our drift just changed. I bet it did. <laughs> Perfect. Get that tag in. Slide that hook up so you guys Alright, Squall's blowing through, it's blowing about 25. We need to catch a Cabrera, we just missed one. We 
got some bad weather on the radar there. Storms are brewing. Let's see if the storm provides. <laughs> we got we got a big one on, guys. in the water. Oh, oh, holy moly. Oh Take that snapper out. Oh, 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 he is engulfed it. Alright. Big giant cabana snapper. Damn. Stonemaster. Oh my god. How about that Stonemaster? He inhaled it. We actually caught one. We came up here to catch a cabana and we got one. Vic, how old are you? 45, Vic, 71. You ever catch one before? An old 71 too. The fish pulled us down to the gunnel, but we got back up and got our composure and got him out of the wreck. Monster Cabrera snapper. Oh, he's Jesus. trying to snap, oh my god. Look at those teeth right there. Oh, he's angry. Look at those teeth right there. Holy moly. God, I don't think you're a big Cabrera snapper. Oh, we actually big caught one. one. Good job. Big one, dude. I think the other one's bigger. Hey, look at this picture. The, the one you had? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this one just got me out of position. Yeah. We got a Cabrera snapper. We came up here to catch one and we caught one. Now we're going for number two. All right, I'm going down. I don't catch many fish anymore. Usually I'm driving the boat, but I've never caught a Cabrera. I'm gonna try. As you saw, they're mean and they're tough. Oh, come on, baby. Full drag, baby, full drag, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Big Cabrera. Red light on the back end here. Yep. Right? Oh, I got shark. No. Eat the bait. Eat the lobster. These things are harder to catch than I thought. Couple times, I need to catch one. Drop your butt, drop your butt to look around. There you go. And up and crank, there you go. Drop your butt, come back and crank. Come on, Foster, come on, yep. Foster. You got him, Foster, you got him. <laughs> turn Tough guys, not easy. All right, so Vic caught a nice Cabrera. It was exciting. We hooked a few more, couldn't get them. Sharks really beat us up. They got a couple in the wreck, but uh, we got one. That's what we came for. Fish late, big moon up there. You can see it up in the sky behind me. We're gonna run home in the dark, and uh, we'll show you that fish tomorrow when the sun comes out. I might hang them up, weigh them tonight, see what he weighs in at.
the moment of truth. See whether it stays on the table. Forty-five pound Cabrera snapper, you guys. We worked hard for him. We got one. We got worked a few times after that, but Vic got his first one. There it was an exciting battle. Cool to see. Clean up tomorrow. Second biggest one I've seen. Now time to wash the boat. It's three in the morning, I never stay up this late. We're gonna do a quick clean, spray and go, and we'll come deal with this tomorrow. So we're gonna clean the Cabrera snapper. We iced him down overnight. There he is. A couple bugs left over. Oh yeah. Oh my, look at that. Oh yeah. Look at that snapper. <laughs> that snapper's as big as you. <laughs> look at those teeth. Man, that fish weighs more than you. Oh my god, look at those. They're huge. Look at that mustache. <laughs> All right, we're gonna clean this bad boy up. That was a little one, baby. Five and seven pounds. You got a video of yourself Look at that? the scales. Yeah, who the hell, somebody, oh, Thomas was just over in the Bahamas. Billy son. Right. And they were fun. Look at the size of that scale right there. Huge scales. Big teeth. Now that is a big snapper. Just in time, Kenny. That is a big one. They fight, huh, Nick? Brutal. And, yeah, it was a good fight, Nick? Yeah, brutal. That's a fillet of snapper. So that fish ate that lobster last night? That's one of our hooks that was all the way in his stomach, so he inhaled that lobster. We're gonna do a head mount with this fish. So we got a bunch of meat here. We're gonna go cook it up, see how it turns out. Cabrera snapper. All right, so Kenny stopped by. He stopped by in the swordfish video. He's getting some uh, Cabrera snapper now. Me and Kenny are going fishing next week, right? Monday. On Monday, we're going fishing, so. We're gonna see kill him. <laughs> I hope so. Me we need a big day. All right, enjoy the snapper, Kenny. Yep. So I cleaned up that Cabrera snapper. We're gonna cook some of it up right now. We also caught an Alfonsino the other day, and I had a piece of that in my fridge that I wanted to cook. So I may stick this video in the end of that video too, when I do that Alfonsino video. But anyhow, here's the piece of Cabrera snapper right there. You can see it's nice thick white meat. And there's the Alfonsino right there. A little bit skinnier, longer piece. Nice chunk of Cabrera there. We're gonna go basic and simple, salt and pepper, a little bit of garlic and some olive oil in the pan. See how it turns out. Here goes the Alfonsino. Cut the garlic in there. Oh yeah, look at that. The Alfonsino looks done. We're gonna take that up now. Ooh, what's that? I'll put it on the plate right there. That fish is so thick, it's still rare in the middle there. We're gonna have to keep it in here for an extra minute. That piece of Cabrera snapper was really thick. I should have cut it in half and did it, but I left it in a big chunk, so. It's still in the pan. Cook in there, as you can see it. We got the lid on the pan. I'm gonna try to butter that Alfonsino when it's nice and warm. There's the Alfonsino right there. Got some potatoes. Sadie and Sarah are out doing girl things. So this is the first time I've ever tried Alfonsino. Really pretty fish, red. Let's see what it tastes like. A oh, flaky, come right apart. Nice and white. Let's taste test it. It's really good, really soft. Nice chunk of meat right there. It's time to try the Cabrera snapper. Nice and white, nice crisp edge on it. Touch of garlic, let's see how it goes. It's a little denser. The Alfonsino is a lot softer. That's a little denser. Not bad though. Not bad at all, nice and white. Cabrera snapper, fresh from last night. Fun fish to catch. Sadie and Sarah are out of the house right now, so I'm gonna eat by myself. But I hope y'all enjoyed that video. Hit that subscribe button, give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. We had a blast catching that Cabrera, 
and the ones that got away, I'm coming back for you next time. Thanks for watching. We got them nice potatoes right there. Those are microwavable potatoes.